So how's it going my nofap and semen retention brothers? So in today's video, I'm going to be discussing with you guys why you feel like a god when you're on semen retention. And I'm not even exaggerating. Not even a little bit. First thing guys, is discipline. Majority of the society or the people that you see today, they lack discipline tremendously. Why? Because of technology. Technology has taken over their lives. Okay, they literally go to technology for every single little thing. They have 24 access to things like pornography. They have 24 seven access to things like social media where they just post things for instant gratification. Instant freaking gratification is killing these people. They don't even realize it. Only the freaking billionaires in this world actually know how good it feels to have delayed gratification. They know that they have to put in work in order to get somewhere. They know that instant gratification is for the people who don't want to do shit in life. Okay? Another thing is that nowadays, for some reason, it's okay for you to be mediocre. And society is actually pushing this. Think about like 30 years ago. How would people feel if you know they were fat? They would actually want to do something with their body. They would want to work out. Now, it's saying, all right, you know what? You're fat, that's completely fine. If anything, that's better than freaking working out. That's how ridiculous it has become nowadays, okay? They're saying it's okay to be fat, just you know, you should love yourself the way you are and carry on like that. What if you get freaking heart disease? You're still supposed to love yourself like that? It's ridiculous, it's so stupid, man. Another thing is that you're able to make decisions easily, all right, compared to the average person who's very indecisive and does not know what to do next or does not know where to go in life. You, on the other hand, being on semen retention and being disciplined, you know exactly what you want from life and you know what decision is going to help you become the best version of yourself. Another thing, guys, energy. Now, energy and drive, all right, guys? Your energy is going to be way higher then literally, I'm not even going to say every other person, I'm going to say literally almost every person that you come across, your energy is going to be way higher. Your vibrations are going to be way higher. All right, guys, you're going to be able to get a lot more things done. I myself find satisfaction now in actually getting things done every single time because I'm trying to be the best version of myself every freaking moment. Okay. Another thing is you're going to be able to manifest the right things with this energy that you have inside you. The positive energy is going to attract the positivity towards you. If you wanted a job, that job is more than likely going to come to you. Okay, but you're going to have to create it with the right vibration. You can't go in there with a mindset like, okay, I applied for the job. You know, if I get it, I get it. It's fine. But if you actually think, I'm going to get this job. All right, I'm going to get this car. I'm going to, I'm going to get this career. It's going to happen. If you have that kind of mindset, it will happen for you. You'll be able to manifest it, guys. All right? Another thing is you're going to be able to transmute your energy that you're not wasting anymore onto doing more productive activities. Okay? And you're going to be able to attract the right people in your life. This is a huge one, guys. Okay? If you're currently attracting negativity in your life, it's because of the way you probably feel about yourself or the way you think about other people okay and you're going to be able to have better sex this is in my personal opinion i don't know how many guys have actually experienced this if you have let me know but i just feel you're going to be able to have better sex because you just feel a lot better about yourself okay and you know that you're not going to be wasting your semen because you're on semen retention and you're going to be practicing nine ejaculatory orgasms if you have not been practicing that do not have sex all right guys and you're going to be able to get in better workouts, hence better freaking muscle gain, man. I've been hitting new PRs pretty much every freaking week. And it's Ramadan, man. All right? I'm not eating or drinking any water. But I'm still freaking making new PRs every week. I'm that freaking disciplined now by being on semen retention. All right? I'm that freaking decisive. I have that much freaking energy now without eating, without even drinking water, man. All right. Another thing, spirituality, you're going to become a lot more spiritual. You're going to be able to love things that are not materialistic. All right. Unlike every other guy out there who just wants materialistic things, you know, just to make himself happy. You are happy with what you have and you're you enjoy being out in nature. Unlike most people who like to be buried in their phones, you actually like to explore. 
Another thing is your glow, okay? You're gonna be carrying this kind of glow and this kind of aura every single place that you go that you are unknowingly going to become the life of the party. It's not like you want to be that, but because of semen retention, because of the positivity inside you, you're gonna be becoming the life of the party. Everybody's gonna be, for some reason, they're gonna feel this kind of magnetism towards you. All right, all the positive people are going to attract towards you. A lot of people will also be envious of you, okay? But don't worry about that because we're trying to become the best version of, myself, of ourselves every single moment. And that is what you will become on semen retention.